hi guys welcome back to my channel in this video i'll be making a detailed tutorial on how to cut and sew a bubu kaftan gown with high collar and front slit please subscribe like and share thank you in making this gown i use a taffeta material ankara material a scissors a chalk, a tape, a tailor's curve, I started by folding the Ankara material into two folds. I fold the first one. And then fold the second one, just as in the video. So I arrange it properly on the table. I mark 3.5 inches width for the neckline. For the shoulder, I mark 8 inches, which is half of my shoulder length. And the remaining 15 inches is the sleeve length. For the back neck depth, I marked 1 inch. Then I use my tailor's curve to draw a curve. For the front neck depth, I marked 9 inches. Then I used my ruler to draw a line from the point to the shoulder line. The measurement from my shoulder to my waistline is 18 inches. From my shoulder to the hip line is 25 inches. So I use my ruler to draw a vertical line across the waistline. And the hip line. The measurement around my waistline is 38 inches. I divided 38 inches by 4, which gives me 9.5 inches. Then I marked plus 3 inches allowance. My round hip measurement is 44 inches. I divided 44 inches by 4, which gives me 11 inches plus 3 inches allowance. I have already cut out my full length, which is 56 inches, plus 2 inches for folding. Now I repeated the hip line measurement at the hem line because it is a straight gown. For the armhole, I measured 12 inches from the shoulder line. Then I used my ruler to draw a straight line across. This line is the chest line. On the chest line, I measured my round boss measurement. The measurement around my bust is 40 inches. I divided 40 inches by 4, which gives me 10 inches, 
then I marked plus 3 inches allowance. I use my ruler to connect all the points together, just as I'm doing in the video. I made a curve at the armhole with my tailor's curve. Or you can use your free hand to make a curve. Then I cut out the marked line with my scissors. At the center front, I marked out 2 inches from the chest line to the hem line. Then I connect the points with my ruler. Now I extended the line to the shoulder line. Then I blended the sharp edge, just as in the video. So I used my scissors to cut out the back neckline. Then I separated the front and the back piece. So I am arranging it properly. After arranging the material, I cut out the 2 inches marked at the center front, that is from the hemline to the shoulder line. This is the 9 inches marked for the front neckline. To the 9 inches marked, I measured from the back neck to the front neck. This gives me 13 inches. So I repeated the measurement to be sure. Now I measured from the back neckline down to the hemline so I would know the length of the fitter I will cut. This gives me 63 inches plus extra 2 inches to be at a safe side. I gave a notch at the back neck so I would know where to attach the taffeta material. For the taffeta, I cut out 6 inches width. Then unfold. I measured 65 inches for the length. On the taffeta, I measured 13 inches and marked with my chalk. I made a line across with my ruler. This is the 13 inches marked earlier 
from the back neck to the front neck. I looked for the middle point of the taffeta and marked all the way down. Then I used my ruler to draw a straight line. I marked 15 inches from the hemline all the way up. This is for the front slit. So I will go to my sewing machine and sew through the straight line. After I sew through the straight line, I turn up the taffeta to the right side from the middle of the material, just as I'm doing in the video. I have given it a good press with iron. You can see the opening for the neck and the opening for the front slit. This is the right side of the Ankara material. I place the taffeta material on the Ankara material. I hold together the middle of the taffeta material and the back neck of the Ankara material that I notched with my office pin. I hold it all the way round down to the hemline with my office pin. After I pin it down, I will go to my sewing machine to sew all the way round. For the round sleeve, I cut out 4 inches width and 25 inches length for both the sleeve. Now I place the wrong side of the sleeve and the right side of the taffeta together. Then I'll go to my sewing machine and sew it through. Then I turn the taffeta material to the right side of the Ankara material. At the other end, I fold in 0.5 inch inward and sew on top of the taffeta. I repeated the same process at the other sleeve. So I cut off the excess material at the end of the sleeve. Now I turn the Ankara to the wrong side. Then I sew from the side of the sleeve to the hemline. I fold the hemline and sew through the end. This is the result, a bubu kaftan gown with a high collar and front slit. Hey guys, thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.